What's going on, nerd Troys? How's everybody's day doing? Hope everybody's having a great, great day today. Um, why is Nightwing movie getting canceled by Warner Brothers? Stay tuned in the next video. Hey guys, we're back on the Nightwing movie news. Um, so the idea for Nightwing movie first came around in early 2017 with Warner Brothers working with Mackley and screenwrite Bill to work on developing the the idea a year later, Mackley said the script was closely to complete, but not a lot has happened since. This most recent interview with the director confirms that Warner Brothers pushed the project back in a favor of other films like BBS, Birds of Prey, and W84, but sad, but said that the movie was not dead. So as of now, Nightwing does appear, appears to still be in the develop. Guys. Get this freaking movie out, Warner Brothers. Everybody in Warner Brothers doesn't uh, don't care about this movie. They don't care about the DC fans, you know what I mean? So Warner Brothers doesn't care about the DC fans, but the DC fans like me and uh, out there want to see a Nightway movie. <clears throat> they don't want to see BDS or Suicide Squad 2 or crappy movies they're making right now over over there Warner Brothers. Listen, Warner Brothers is failing their fan base. And everybody switched to Marvel because Marvel has number one movies right now. Hits right now. But we, we want to see a Darkwing movie. We do. Okay? Absolutely. Absolutely want to see a Darkwing movie coming out soon. Uh, Nightwing, my bad. Nightwing. Darkwing, Nightwing, same thing. Because Batman and Nightwing are... Mostly fight the crime in the nighttime. Uh, makes sense. Uh, but yeah, why, 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 Warner Brothers? Why are you pushing this back? Let's get it out there. Everybody wants to see it. It's still developing. We might see it in another four years. I don't want to see it in another four years. I want to see the movie right now. Who's going to be in it? What's the script about? And I'm going to see a sneak peek. You know, but Warner Brothers. They're idiots. They're idiots about w movies about DC because apparently DC movies are uh, for a full sheep right now because nobody likes them. Really? Suicide Squad 2? Over, over Nightwing movie? <laughs> really? Seriously? You, gotta be, you guys got to be crazy over there in uh, Warner Brothers. But Warner Brothers don't care about us. Uh, a superhero fans they just care about the money and stuff. Uh, people still gonna watch it. Uh, these crappy DC movies, but I'm not. I'm not gonna watch Suicide Squad two or Iron Man two because Amber Heard's in it. Amber Heard is not a toxic person over there in DC. She she she's not a good actor. She she's not. So is Ray Fisher. He's a born cyborg. We want a new cyborg. But that's Warner Brothers for you. Uh, I got some new more news on the Batman. And a uh, Nightwing movie, maybe, and coming up. Uh, I hope, hope, hope we get it, but stay tuned. All right, guys, we're back on some more Nightwing news. So, ben, uh, Batman of the DC uh, uh, world would be after coming the Flash movie would Macri to bring to bring on Ben Affleck, Robert Pattinson, or even key into Garrison's former mentor. Okay, first of all, Ben Affleck's Batman? Hell no. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. Um, don't do it, Chris. Don't bring back, uh, Ben Affleck's Batman. Nobody likes him. Ben Affleck's Batman? It's freaking boring. He's not good at superhero movies. Ben Affleck's horrible. He did bad at Daredevil. And that movie was a flop. That's only time that Marvel was kind of experiencement of the, the their movies and now uh, they get the shit together over there marvel but don't no no okay next one robert patterson batman um we never seen him play batman or he looks good and and then and the sneak peek looks good but can he perform on the big screen can everybody like some is robert patterson going to be good if he does be good okay maybe but Michael Keaton would be makes sense because Michael Keaton is going to be the old Batman version. So, my Dick Harrison might 
team up with Michael Keaton and and stuff in the movie. Then that'd be good. Michael Keaton and Nightwing. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on now. Come on, Chris. Tell Warner Brothers to f off. Let's do it. Come on, man. Why you guys want? Why you guys want Warner Brothers? Why you guys want Michael Keaton and Dick Harrison team up? Why you don't? Why, why you guys don't want it? That would be awesome. Everybody wants to see that. You know, in DC World, everybody wants to see it. But no, DC wants to make these trash movies like Birds of Prey, Batman vs Superman, Suicide Squad, Suicide Squad Two, and many more coming up in the future. I have a concern that the Flash movie is going to be bad. I, that, that's my concern. You know, that's my concern. But I, it, it could be good. But I have a concern. I think DC is going to ruin the Flash movie. I know, because DC's always been ruining the, uh, their movies and their fan base f for forever right now. Okay, so uh, why? Why Night Wayne was getting? Why Night Wayne is getting canceled? It's just bad for for business. Okay, it's basically Chris wants wants a, a DC movie to be good. And Night, I think Nightwing would be a good movie for the DC fans out there. But he can't have that power because Warner Brothers is a big company. They're a billion dollar company. And they, they can do whatever with the um, DC movies. They can make them good trash. But, yo, listen. Get your fucking shit together, Warner Brothers, okay? We want to see a Nightwing movie. You know? I don't know. I want to see it. I don't know why they're pushing the back for four freaking years, and it's still in, it's still in develop. Just get it out there, okay? Why why are you waiting for the after the Flash movie? Why? Just get Nightwing's own movie, okay? Okay, after the Flash movie, get the movie started. Get Michael Keaton in it. Makes sense. Michael Keaton's going to play the old Batman. Meets up with Dick Harrison. Be the mentor of uh, Dick Harrison. Because in the comments, comments, Dick Harrison was Batman for, for a little bit. Because people thought Bruce Wayne died and in the comics and in the, in the TV show, but he didn't. Um, so I, I think Dick Harrison would be a good fit for in, in, in the DC world. I, I think it would. Um, people would be like, oh, I, I thought Jason Todd, Jason Todd was Dick Harrison. No. Jason Todd is the Red Hood. It's a different... I'm going to tell you guys something. There's a lot of Robins out there. Stay tuned. Guys, we're back on the Nightwing news and um, some, some little bit Robin news. Um, the backstory of it. So, Robin is multiple characters. You have Dick Harrison, Jason Todd, Tim Drake, and Damon Wayne. Uh, Dick Harrison was the original Robin... And you saw him in Batman Forever with uh, George Clooney. George Clooney, uh, you know, and then he saw Barbara Gordon, aka Batgirl, and uh, Batman Forever movie. But Batman Forever was—I want to talk about that. that. That movie was a disaster. That movie was not a, a disappointment. There we go. Uh, but you saw his backstory. Now over here in DC, the universe, we saw. Robin's suit and Batman was staring at it and that's uh, Jason Todd's Batman and stuff but Jason Todd didn't really die Superboy uh, kind of like made him come up the grave again revive him and Dick I mean Jason Todd become Red Hood and Red Hood man he's a savage bro I'm telling you are we going to see a Red Hood in Batman movie? Um, I hope so. I hope so. But Warner Brothers is not like to be creative with their movies right now. Why is Warner Brothers not going to do to do their stories like the TV show do? Like the TV shows on on, 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 Net, on HBO Max, the cartoon ones are good, and the live action movies are crappy. Dude, I'm telling you, DC make DC can make good um, uh, animated cartoons. They can. For Batman, Wonder Woman, Superman, the whole universe of DC 
cartoons on the TV show are great. But no, DC wants to ruin some good potential movies and a lot of times because I don't know why, because I don't know. DC right now and Warner Brothers are just crap in the bed right now. It's funny that if Ben Affleck plays Nightwing in the Nightwing movie, that movie's going to be trash, bro. It is. Dude, what? Ben Affleck is not a good fit for Batman. He's not. I'm sorry. The best Batman we have since years is Christian Bale and Michael Keaton. That's it. The rest of them sucks. George Clooney, Val Kilmer. Horrible, bro. But the only good, the only good two Batmans in, in history of DC, of live action films, is Michael Keaton and Christian Bale. That's it. That's it. And, and you, you guys can argue with me that Ben Affleck's a good Batman. Okay, argue with me because I'm going to win. How's Ben Affleck good? We never seen him in the play in a Batman movie and stuff. At least we saw Michael Keaton and Christian Bale have their own Batman movies. Ben Affleck never had his own Batman movie. But that's Warner Brothers for a year right now. And they're screwing it up. Hey, I'm, I guess I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you something. Back in the day of Michael Keaton's Batman, it was great, dude. DC was on the good path since... DC was on the good path since... And then they have Val Kilmer, you know, and that was crappy. They have Christian Bale nail the Batman part. And Warner Brothers did good on that one. And now we have Ben Affleck. It's like, dude, really? There was doing good, crappy, good, now crappy. Uh, while, and bro, hey, Robert Pattinson might revive the Batman character in the Batman universe. And he might, he might surprise people and blow people's mind that he can be good Batman. I think Robin pa Robert Pattinson is going to be a good freaking Batman. The movie looks dark, the plot looks dark, and he's going to be good and stuff. I, I think Robert Pattinson is going to nail the Batman part. I, I hope he teams up with Nightwing. That'd be cool. Might see that in the, of the end of the movie of Robert Pattinson's Batman. But might see that, and that'd be freaking awesome. See the next video. All right, guys, we're about to wrap this thing up quickly. Uh... Guys, leave me a comment. Do you guys want to see a Nightwing movie with uh, Ben Affleck or Robert Pattinson or Michael Keaton? Let me know. Let me know. It, guys, everybody has different opinions. It, it, some people might, oh yeah, we'll see, we'll see a Ben Affleck movie. People might, no, we'll see a Robert Pattinson mo in, in, in movie in Nightwing. No, we'll see a Michael Keaton in Nightwing movie. Let me know in the comments. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that big sub button. Make sure you hit that bell button to see all my notifications to pop up for the next video. And please, please, please have a good day, guys. And deuces.